Welcome to Engineering Update, brought to you by Mauser Electronics, the electronic components distributor with the widest selection of the newest products. I'm Casey Panetta, Managing Editor of ECN. In this week's headlines, steerable paper planes, an educational robotic fish, and a cursive critiquing robotic pen. A robotics team from the University of Queensland has created two versions of a single-use UAV. The unmanned aerial vehicles, which are usually associated with clandestine military operations, are both designed to relay environmental information. The first, called the polyplane, is your basic high-tech airplane designed using an avionics system that allows the vehicle to steer itself to a predetermined destination. It uses small tabs and an onboard control system. The second UAV, called the Samara, draws its inspiration from the maple seed featuring a circuit board attached to a solid leading edge weight that doubles as an antenna and a flexible wing. Both vehicles are designed to help save lives in a forest fire by working as self-deploying sensor modules. The Swiss Federal Institute of Technology, which previously had a hand in developing robotic tuna fish and sea turtles, recently developed a new fish with the sole purpose of educating teenagers about technology and biology. The robot, which weighs about 15 pounds and is about 20 inches long, is called Naronenen. It features an anodized aluminum frame and a Raspberry Pi running Linux and ROS as its main controller, a LiPo battery that lasts about two hours, and a pump that fills a diving cylinder. The kit allows for student-designed fins to be attached anywhere on the robot using LEGO Technic connectors to demonstrate how different fins will affect the motion. Plans to add a camera module so that students will be able to see what the fish does are in the works. The LearnSiv pen features built-in hand recognition technology and software that will vibrate to alert the writer of any spelling errors. It uses an embedded Linux system and circuit board with memory, Wi-Fi, vibration modules, and motion sensors with a gyroscope and accelerometer. The pen, originally featured on Kickstarter, has two modes, orthography for spelling and calligraphy for working on form, and it can be used in conjunction with specialty apps. The catch? The writing must be in cursive, so good luck with that. That wraps up this week's report. Be sure to join the conversation on Facebook, Twitter, and LinkedIn. I'm Casey Panetta, and this has been your Engineering Update.